All right, guys, I'm back here, and luckily, in the last video, you guys saw that I was able to finally get a drone recording out of this thing. So here we go. I'll turn it back on. I will press on the memory card is in there. I'll press on the record. You can see it's red, meaning that it is a recording. And I will try lifting it off the ground a little bit. All right. It did a funny thing. Then I will press the stop recording on there. Let's turn off the drone. Turn off the remote. And we will then go over to the computer where things will be interesting. Hopefully and it will run just as well as it did before because just because I got it to run once doesn't mean it's going to run again. So let's make sure that it does a second time. Because I don't trust it unless I know it's repeatable, right? It's got to be repeatable. Uh, what is it doing now? Come on. Please insert a disk. Well, I did. I just inserted a disk. Come on. All right, see, this is why I always make sure things are repeatable. It only worked once, better work twice. Well, I can't say that it's good. Here we go, USB, come on. Wake up, USB. The beauty of technology, right? Please insert a disk in the USB. I have. I have just literally, <laughs> I have just literally inserted a disk. The beauty of technology, yes. It is fantastic, especially because it doesn't work. All right, so this should be the second video with me flying and then capsizing the drone. Let's see if it actually works. And there it is. I'm flying, I'm flying, and ta-da, it works. All right, thanks for watching, guys. See you in the next one.